Hello investors, welcome to Trade Wins. In this video, we are going to discuss fundamental analysis versus technical analysis of stocks. First of all, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe. We publish new interesting investing videos every week. There are two common approaches to pick stock. The first is fundamental analysis and the second is technical analysis. However, fundamental analysis and technical analysis follows a completely different route to pick stocks. Both fundamental analysis and technical analysis can be used to determine if the investment in a stock is attractive or not and to further forecast the future trends of the stock. For example, if you are evaluating 10 stocks and want to determine which one you should purchase, then you can use either fundamental or technical analysis of stocks. Fundamental analysis checks how healthy the company is compared to its competitors and economy. It studies everything related to the company like its financial statements, that is balance sheet, profit loss statement, cash flow statements, its management, competitors, products, economy, industry, etc. On the other hand, technical analysis does not care about the financials of the company. It evaluates the company based on its price trends, prices, volumes, etc. Technical analyst uses the stock charge to identify future trends and patterns. Now before we discuss further about technical and fundamental analysis, it's important that you understand what is the intrinsic value of a company. According to Investopedia, the intrinsic value is the actual value of a company or an asset based on an underlying perception of its true value including all aspects of the business in terms of both intangible and tangible factors. In short, intrinsic value is the true value of a company. Fundamental analysts believe that the current stock price of a company may or may not be same as the intrinsic value. In other words, they believe that a stock can be overvalued or undervalued at a particular time. They evaluate companies to find which one is trading below its true intrinsic value using different studies like financial statements, stock evaluation, economy analysis, etc. Once they find a company which is trading below its true intrinsic value, also called as undervalued stock, they hold this stock until it reaches its true value. A stock trading below its intrinsic value is considered as a good investment opportunity for the value investors. Overall, the approach followed by the fundamental analysis is to find the intrinsic value of the stock. On the other hand, technical analysts believe that there is no use to analyze company's intrinsic value as the stock price already reflects all the relevant info. They do not care about the financials of a stock. They predict the future performance of a stock based on its past price trends. Now that you have a little understanding of both fundamental and technical analysis of stocks, let us discuss both their methodologies in details. Here we will compare fundamental versus technical analysis of stocks based on different criteria. First, basic principle. Fundamental analysis analyzes all the factors that can affect the stock price of a company in the future like financials, management, industry, etc. It evaluates the intrinsic value of a company to find whether the stock is underpriced or overpriced. On the other hand, technical analysis reads the past charts, patterns and trends of a stock to predict its future price movement. Second time frame. Fundamental analysis approach is used for long-term investments. On the other hand, technical analysis approach is used for short-term investments. Data sources. Fundamental analysis gathers data from financial statements of a company along with other economic news sources. On the other hand, technical analysis gathers data from stock charts. Indicators Fundamental analyst studies assets, liabilities, earnings, expenses, etc. It also uses various fundamental indicators like PE ratio, price to book value ratio, debt to equity ratio. ROE, etc. Technical analysis uses charts like candlesticks, price data, etc. Various technical indicators that are commonly used are MACD, Simple Moving Average, Exponential Moving Average, RSI. Methodology used 
Fundamental analysis studies the financial data like balance sheet, profit and loss statement, and cash flow statements. It also examines other factors while evaluating stocks like, like its competitors, company's management, industry, economy, etc. Fundamental analysis focuses on both the past performance and the future potential of a company. On the other hand, technical analyst studies the market movement and public psychology. It is mostly the analysis of the past price movements of the stock. Technical analysis focuses on the performance chart and the trends of the stock. Sixth strategy. Fundamental analysis is used to find the intrinsic or the true value of a company to evaluate whether the stock is overpriced or underpriced. On the other hand, technical analysis is used to find the right time to enter and exit from a stock. Now let's understand few of the pros and cons of the fundamental and technical analysis. We will start with the fundamental analysis. The pros of fundamental analysis are first, the fundamental analysis invests for the long term and hence the returns are quite huge. Here the power of compounding is working in the favor of the investors. And second, they invest in the financially sound companies which is always a good approach. The cons of fundamental analysis are Fundamental analysis is quite laborious and, and its methodology is lengthy and complex. Second, there is no clear time frame for the long term investment. It can go for 10 years, 20 years or even more. As the future potential of a company is considered in the fundamental analysis, various assumptions are made in this approach. For example, if you are finding the intrinsic value of a company using DCF, you might be forecasting the future free cash flow, growth rate, return rate, etc. And all these are assumptions which can be a little incorrect. And the last is, as the entry and exit time is not specified in the fundamental analysis, so you might buy a good stock at a bad time. Technical Analysis the pros of the technical analysis are, it is fast and the outcomes can be seen quite early. This approach is comparatively less laborious. The entry and exit time for a stock can be specified using the technical analysis tools. And further, technical indicators readily give buy and sell indications. The cons of technical analysis are, as there are a number of technical indicators, it's really tough to select the best one. Second. Technical indicators do not study the financials or the fundamentals of a company and hence you might be investing in a financially unhealthy company. And last, technical analysis requires a lot of accuracy, reliability and discipline. So let's quickly summarize what we learned in this video. Both technical and fundamental analysis are effective way to make money from the stock However, the methodologies used in both these methods are totally different. It is really tough to say which one is better way of investing or trading in stock. Although a number of books has been written on both fundamentals and technical analysis. However, that this debate on the better way of investing is still going on. Our suggestion is to do your own study and make your investing strategy based on your knowledge, preference and time. That's all for this video. I hope it is useful to you. Please subscribe to the channel and if you like this video, please hit the like button. This is Kritesh shining off.